learning. Let's launch our online classes with a prayer. I will instruct you and teach you in the way you should go. I will counsel you with my loving eye on you. Psalm 32 verse 8. Heavenly Father, we come before you today with an attitude of gratitude. As we stand at the threshold of this new initiative, gazing at the unknown tomorrow with varied thoughts, feelings, plans and projects, help us to move ahead with our eyes fixed on you. This pandemic has brought with it daunting challenges for all our stakeholders and we seek your divine guidance as we face them each day. As teachers adapt and evolve their methodology to the online world to create a climate for optimal teaching and learning, we pray for physical, emotional, and spiritual blessings on them. We continue to pray for your gracious spirit to work through our students as they engage in this online learning. Give us the grace to operate with patience and flexibility as we work towards bringing that routine back to our students through virtual classes. We implore you to equip us to teach with truth, encourage us to teach with vision, and empower us to teach with love. Lord, you are the way maker, miracle worker, promise keeper, light in the darkness. May normalcy and healing soon be restored and keep us safe under your banner of protection. We make this prayer in your mighty name. Amen. A very good morning to all of you, dear teachers. I hope you are well and steering ahead through these unprecedented times. 29th April 2020, the outcome of my meeting with the deans was a unanimous decision to shift from traditional methodologies of teaching to online digital education. This appears to be a viable solution to fill in the void for classroom education during this period until regular classes on campus resume. The college may be closed, but continuous learning must be the order with each passing day. It was therefore imperative that you dear teachers get involved in the modalities of virtual teaching. To minimize the impact of this present scenario, you were expected to curate resources for at least 30% of the syllabus to be delivered through a virtual platform for the upcoming academic year 2020-21. We are professionally and morally responsible to continue the education of our students. And it is commendable to note that you teachers have spent time preparing your materials for online teaching. When it comes to e-learning, content has an important role to play. It must be well designed, otherwise our purpose is defeated. At the outset, I would like to congratulate you for the keen interest shown while steering to the complexities of online teaching. I feel confident that you have been working hard to integrate technology seamlessly into the curriculum and to provide a fruitful academic experience for our students and make this time a productive and happy one for them. These experiences have taught us resilience a quality that is essential in everything we aspire to accomplish and surpass. As we launch these classes, if there are technical difficulties, please bring it to the notice of our IT enabled service team so we could work together to rectify those issues and make our initiative more fulfilling and significant. Teachers, you are expected to record your lectures to enable students to access the session at a later stage 
in case of connectivity issue. All the best. Thank you. God bless.